I have a little secret to tell you all about David's height. <laughs> it better not involve the number five, because... <laughs> so there was this one time where David was convinced that he is six foot tall. Um, and so and one I am time tall, so. at 3 a.m. At, at Yahoo, we decided, to liter we decided to measure very precisely. Um, and it turned out, nobody knows this, is that David is actually 5'11". Um, and so for this talk, I'm going to actually be standing down here to give this David a little bit of respect. <laughs> yes, thank you so much to Charlotte for getting the platform so I can... <laughs> yeah, it's really for David. The platform is for David. Okay, everyone. Well, welcome to the first Back to the Stack. We're so excited to have all of you here. This is an amazing, amazing turnout. So really excited to ha um, welcome you all back to Full Stack. Let's see. So... Back to the stack, alums.join. I think this is our first, um, you know, we were sitting around brainstorming this. We were really thinking, you know, we have so many amazing alumni out there. How can we create something that would be fun? Yes, that's, that's you. Um, how can we make something fun, uh, exciting, and educational for us to all come back together and, um, and really kind of, you know, get, get to know each other beyond uh, the cohort that you are in? So I'll get started. The first thing I want to do is see who's from which cohort. So let's start here. Who's from the first cohort? Back when we were so dorky, we named it classes after the binary numbers. <laughs> Who's and from the first cohort? Is there anyone? Jorge? Jorge. Awesome. Scott? Scott? <coughs> I don't know where Scott is. Scott's over there. Um, OK, what about the second cohort? Yeah, back there, Migi. OK, Migi, Russ, and um, what about uh, 1404? By the way, your loudness will be considered uh, a measurement 1404, of yours. Yeah. yeah. 1406, class 100, the last of the binary classes. No, I think that was the last one was 111. Oh, well, after that, okay. we realized that binary numbers grow in length very quickly. <laughs> so, uh, little mistake. All right, who is uh, class 1406, class 100? No class 100ers, huh? Oh, Christian. Christian. Yeah. Okay. Single representation. Oh, Jenna, yeah. Oh, Jenna, you're a class. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Class one. Then Gabe must have been too. Well, you're in 101 too. Oh, that's right. That's right. Wait, Jenna did 101. Okay. 101. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there we go. 110. Hey. <laughs> that's awesome. That's it? Jeremy. Only one 110? Jeremy and Ayana. Oh, okay, okay. Two. Any other one tens? Okay. Can't see Boo. It. Okay, one eleven. All right. There's All right. a lot of you here. You guys are quiet. Where's every? Yeah, where's everybody from? Everyone's crashing the party. Okay. <laughs> it's like. All right. It's like uh, awesome. Awesome. All right. Fifteen oh one. Yeah. Fifteen oh one. All right. Okay. Uh, Fifteen oh one flex. Flex? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. 1503. <laughs> all right, all right. There we go. 1503. All right. 1504. <laughs> oh, that's, yeah. That's recent. 1504 Flex. Yeah. yeah. One. Uh, 1506. Yeah. Yeah. No, 1507. <laughs> you got to remember your own class, people. It's rule number uno. <laughs> All right, 1507. Okay, okay, awesome, All awesome, right. very cool. Okay. Um, we, yeah, we just had our two-year anniversary. That was great, and so a lot of great classes here. Um, I also want to introduce all the full-stack staff, in case, in case many of you don't know them. Uh, we'll start with Joe. Joe's not here tonight, is he? Is Joe here? All right, boo. Omri? Omri's here. Omri! Scott? Scott! Uh, Mark? So Mark is a program manager. Shauna? Yeah. Eric? Eric's not here tonight. Uh, Charlotte? Woo! All right. Gabe? Yeah. Liz Levy? All right. Nimit? Yeah. Huntley? Where's Huntley? All right. Where's Huntley? Gabe, uh, Gabriella? 
Gabriella's not here. All right, uh, Zeke. Yeah, Zeke. Mogan, he's pretty recent hire. Mogan in the back. Yeah, Mogan. All right, Mogan. <laughs> Griffin. Yeah, Griffin. All right, Ayana. And myself. Thank you. And David. And David. Boo. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so we'll go over the agenda for tonight. Uh, right now, we're doing full stack, uh, back to the stack welcome. That's right now. And then we'll have um, our keynote speaker, Valeri. He's the man who coined the term mean stack, also the maintainer of Mongoose. Um, 7.30 to 8, we'll have a company types panel. So we'll have people on, up here on stage talking about the various types of companies, what it's like, because um, I know many of you are you know, in your first job, and say, what's it like working for a big company? Or what's it like to work for a small company? Uh, what's it like to work for something in FinTech or you know, consumer startup? Then we'll have alumni tech talks. We have uh, three or four great tech talks lined up um, from alumni. And then finally, we'll have networking until uh, end of the night. And uh, yeah, super excited to kind of catch up with all of you and see how things are going. All right, and we wanted to, uh, in the f for the first back to sec, we also want to talk a little bit about uh, what we want to do with back to this sec. Um, and so, you know, we, we get emails all the time, and I think it's something that it's hard uh, for alumni, you know, for us to kind of share with all of you, is that how many people are working on cool things in cool places? So, um, it's really heartwarming to see how many students are out there, like solving challenging problems, making things better for people, working in, um, you know, just using computers to, to make the world better. And so, we really want to kind of create opportunity for all of you to come together and show each other, talk to each other what you're talking about, and, um, and really, you know, mingle across the classes. Um, so, yeah, we get, we get many great emails from you we want you to share with each other. Also, you know, I think it's, it's kind of a weird thing, right? Like, we're all, we're all share this one experience together, and we all kind of get where each other can come from. And so we, we have some things that uh, we're going to talk about later about, you know, how can we help each other out as we grow our career? Not only can how can full stack help you, but how can your alumni network help you? And um, you know, it's a unique experience, and I think that for many early years in your career, it can really help to kind of keep keep um, you know connecting with each other and talking with each other about how to really excel in a coding career. Uh, no, you want to talk about some of the additional things, or? Yeah. Uh, Hello. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> by the way, we got a, a brand new sound system, uh, and yeah, that's why it sounds so loud. Um, so, <clears throat> so back to the stack. Uh, the the conference today. Our 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 goal is to um, to connect people across class lines, um, right? Um, and so you you all. Um, you all have been through a similar experience, um, and even as you're out in, in your careers, you're going through actually very similar experiences as you develop uh, yourself and as your uh, companies grow. Um, and so, and so, one of the best um, one of the best ways to improve yourself is um, is by networking with other people who who understand you and, and who get you. And so that's uh, like David said, that's the that's the purpose. Um, we're we're hoping. I mean, I guess we, we talked about um, having tech talks and, and panels, um, and and how um, how that's going to work today. But but I, I I think one of the most important parts of today will be um, the the last part where you get to network and, and meet other people. Um, I would really encourage you to not only. Uh, I think I think it's of course great to connect with the people you already know from uh, from your own class. Um, this will be easy for some of the people in the earlier classes who don't have anyone else here, um, <laughs> but <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. We, we love we love you too, um, but but uh, you know do make an effort to join another group or go meet meet uh, someone that you don't know um, and and learn about their company, learn about what they're doing, exchange information, and hopefully keep in touch with them. I think that 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 the last portion is where. Um, you have a certain, you know, like th there's a, a pretty long amount of time for you to get a lot of, um, a lot of value. So try not to do the thing that's the most comfortable thing, which is just talking to people you already know, um, and and move around the room. And I think you'll get a lot out of it. And for the first networking event, or for the as soon as we start networking, we're gonna actually assign your pairs like we normally do. And so you'll have the first. That's just where you start off. Yeah, that's where you start off. Yeah. 
And finally, you know, let us know how we can make this an event that helps you. How can we help you in your career? Um, we definitely think that, um, you know, we definitely think that we want to, um, you know, make full stack something that is really accelerating you beyond just the time that you were here. So however we can make this event or other things that we can do to help you, we'd love to hear that and love to know more from you. All right, um, before we talk about some upcoming stuff, I think one, we got it, what's Charlotte? Charlotte? Where is Charlotte? Charlotte, can you come over here? Charlotte. I think we have to all give Charlotte a huge round of applause. Charlotte? Thank you. I mean, not only all, all the full stack staff helped today, but this uh, back to stack has really been, uh, Charlotte been driving and really, um, you know, getting the speakers, getting the place lined up, um, making this a great event. So. Um, Thank you so much, Charlotte. I think we're super excited. Thank you, to have Charlotte. You. All right, so some things that were upcoming, we'd love to uh, talk to you about and get um, you know just l let you know what we're working on. So one is the um, more alumni programs that we we'd love to brainstorm with you. We have recently started the alum help Slack channel, and we do this because you know we're talking to some students, and it's like it's not always great to go to someone on your team who doesn't know or knows kind of where you're coming from, and just ask them like random questions, right? And so like asking other full stack students who know exactly what you know, what you don't know, um, and also instructors and fellows and all the alum will be in that channel, uh, help you out. And so that's our kind of informal start, but um, if this is helpful, we'll kind of think about structuring that more. So if you're on Slack, uh, if you're not on Slack, you can, we'll set you up afterwards to go get on Slack, but there's a channel where you can chat with each other about questions that you have. By the way, I would say that it's um, so the, the the name of the channel is Al Alum Help, but it's not. I think kind of group channels like this tend to turn into message boards about like m you know I want to rent out my apartment or things like that. <laughs> so like the 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 purpose of the of the channel is to um, is to actually ask technical questions, um, and so you can you know and so if. Um, I think you know we'll have to do a little bit of work to, to get that flow going, uh, but hopefully, um, hopefully this is something that you can use even as you're working to try to kind of contact um, the full stack community when you come across either a great new resource or um, or, or, or you have a question that uh, that's been bugging you that uh, that you think you know. And you know we we love to you know. Um, if it's like you don't even know how to phrase the thing that you're confused about, that's what this, this channel can really help. We can dig in and say, okay, this is how you should start thinking about it. Um, we're probably not going to write any code for you in that channel, but we'd love to help you and make sure that you're not um, doing anything, or to just make you really you know, look, good at, look good at your first job or your jobs afterwards. Second thing is we're putting together a mentor network. So if you're interested in <coughs> mentoring or being mentored, uh, that's something that we're, we're going to, if you specify that you're interested in doing that, we'll be in contact with you s shortly about um, how to participate. Uh, I think this, so, so that part especially applies to people who, like there's a lot of you who've been in the industry now for over a, a year. Um, and and you, you'll be, like you may not think that's a long time, but that's actually a lot of great experience for someone who is just coming uh, coming out and learning about how your first year went. And so that's what we mean by, you know, if you want to be a mentor or you also want to uh, chat with someone. And it, it maybe maybe it could just be both. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, three, job placement support. You know, we've um, continued to grow our um, hiring network and also we have many alum who are placed into, you know, probably most companies in New York have, will, we have secret full stack spies at, so. Um, if you are interested in, in moving career, we also can help you, give you... <laughs> I, I'm not aware of the spies, <laughs> per se. <laughs> so, so if, you're, if you're we do have... We're happy to help you as you're thinking about your next, um, even just talk about job advice. Uh, so feel free to reach out to yeah. us about that. And then finally, alumni interviews. Um, we're, if you look on our website, we're starting to do a lot more work with video. And so if you want to do participate in a one-on-one -on -one interview, we'd love to, to talk to you about, about doing that. We're, that's something that we're launching um, pr pretty shortly. Yeah. There's another thing we're excited about, many of you might have seen, is Grace Hopper Academy. That will be starting in January of this year. And yeah, Ooh. and so we're, we're super excited about it. Um, and we've been, you know, we're starting to take applications and ha getting admissions for that right now. 
And so if you go to gracehopper.com, you can check out kind of more about it, more information. We're also happy to answer questions about it um, afterwards. And finally, we're also launching a new version of our full stack website. So this is a partial screenshot, but if you go to preview.fullstackacademy.com, you'll be able to see it. And if you have anything that you want to, any bug reports or things that you're not sure about, we're, um, we, we'd love to, you know, we we'll really appreciate feedback, it. Yeah. We're, yeah. we're probably going to publicly launch it in maybe a week or two. But yeah, p uh, if, you, if you see something wrong with it, do let us know. Preview.fullstackacademy. And I think, you know, finally, as we we're thinking about this tonight, it's like full stack alums, it's really a pretty uh, special group. Um, so, yes, you. You're part of an elite and growing network. Um, and, you know, I think when we're here together, we're, we're struggling with things, we're trying to figure things out, but um, it was a lot, you know, it was, it's a lot to even get to this point, to, to be, um, being part of here. So, for, you know, for every student at full stack, many were turned away. Um, and so this is a very special group of people that I think is, um, it's really an honor for us to have, to have worked with you. Uh, and I think we're, you know, instructors, staff, Nimit and myself, we are grateful all the time that, um, that you know, our work is to work with some of the smartest people that we ever had a chance to work with. So we, we thank you for that. Um, you know, we, Full Stack alums span every company type, company size, industry, um, and many tech stacks. I know, you know many people are doing Ruby on Rails, Python, Django. Um, I think tonight, I've already talked to four people who are like doing Golang, um, Java, and so all the tech stacks, uh, full stack students have been part of. And then, you know, one thing we, we're really proud of seeing is that companies repeatedly hire full stack grads, right? It's like, um, you know, you can trick them once, but you can't trick them five or six times. And so, <laughs> this is, <laughs> This is something that we're really happy about, um, that we just see people keep coming back to us and saying, I love the person that is working for me. If you can give me more people like this, I'd be so happy. So we see companies like this kind of consistently hire from full stack, and that's something that's really positive to us. And finally, we also hear great things about you from our employers. We hear things like, you know, out of all the coding schools, full stack grads are definitely the best. And we hear things like, as soon as you can, I, like, get me more full stack students ASAP. And so, what? It's secret because we, we don't want everyone to bum rush them and email them to them. So, <laughs> um, but you know, we do hear that all the time. So it's, um, I think that's a testament to you know, how, how awesome you guys have been uh, and, and are. So, so as we uh, kick off tonight, I think one thing Nim and I feel that you know, full stack forever, we, and this is not about, this is about us. We'd love to be involved with you forever in your career and make you awesome. And uh, let, you know, let us know how we can do that, how we can make your um, status as an alumni something that's really exciting. And without further ado, one more review of the agenda. And I am super excited to announce our keynote speaker, Valery Karpov. Valery? I'll give a quick engineer. Uh, let me get you mic'd up. Can you, can you mic him up? Well, can you mic, him, can you mic up, Valery? Yeah, yeah. So,